It's your favorite YouTube dealer. I appreciate you guys for stopping in. We got some new Knox Hill with Jaron Benton. This is an interesting collaboration. So Jaron Benton has been really dope at making music, but I know this man from years and years ago when there was a thing called the WRC Jump Off Two on Twos, which was the World Rap Championships. And it was actually freestyle off the top and they would record like 10 plus battles in one day. He was a part of the Atlanta division with Ness Lee, who went on to become one of the better battle rappers, in my opinion. But back then, when it came to freestyling, I'm going to be honest, Jaron Benton was trash. This man was not very good at freestyling, but I give him all the props in the world for stepping in. And then years later, hearing him make music and I'm like, yo, this shit is lit. This is crazy. So music was his calling, just not in the freestyle battle arena. So shout out to him for making a career out of what he does, because this man is, is extremely good at it. Shout out to Knox for getting this man on a track. I'm interested to dive into this. I also want to give a shout out to Knox for the back and forth that he just had, because some people might feel Knox washed screw. Some people might feel like screw washed Knox. Some people might be in between and they go back and forth. I initially felt like Screw may have edged it a little bit, but then I heard it back again and I'm like, ah, but I can see Knox winning it too. So I'm like, I, I feel like they both just gave us a dope entertaining show. That's that's really how I look at it. I don't think that the winner really matters, but I can understand the argument either way. I think that it was a good time. I loved reacting to him. If you guys haven't seen him, those reactions are up on my channel. And tonight we got more special shit happening. So Eminem is dropping at midnight. It looks like it's going to be a single called Houdini. I will be live on my Twitch, twitch.tv slash Dwayne TV. Link down below if you guys want to stop in. I'll probably be playing some multiverses leading up to it and just, just washing people. So if you play, you can come in and you can get washed as well. I'm down. I, I have no problem. <laughs> I have no problem serving you your ass. But as soon as 1130, 1145 comes, we're going to switch over to waiting for the drop from Eminem. We'll do a reaction live. I'll have chat on screen if you guys want to be a part of it. That way you can give your input. Let me know what you think of it as I do my own reaction that will upload to YouTube. And we'll go from there. Now, if you can't make it, it will be uploaded to YouTube. So anyways, apologize for the long intro. Just a lot of things to talk about. Let's uh, let's get into this. It's called on to the next one. And uh I guess it's it's kind of appropriate given the whole back and forth and it's like, all right, now we're done with that. On to the next one. Let's get into this. Let's see what this one's all about. Tell me that you vibing, you ain't got it. You ain't got it. Tell me that it's Tommy, you the problem. You're the problem. Yeah. Tell me who is riding, you ain't on it. You ain't on it. Tell me that you flying, you ain't drop shit. On, on to the next one, ring the alarm. On to the next one, on, I'm on. On to the next one, ring the alarm. On to the next one, armed, I'm on. They love to talk about me, I know. Got drive on the idols at the top, I don't do titles. Will I stop, I don't do rivals. I just hop in a new cycle. When I drop it, it go viral. Now my pockets need lipo, whoa. Whoa. <laughs> my man said my pockets need lipo. I wish my pockets needed lipo. They are not fat. Not, not in the least bit, but you know, we're working on it. Hopefully one day. On, on to the next one, ring the alarm. On to the next one, on, I'm on. On to the next one, ring the alarm. On to the next one, on, I'm on. They love to talk about me, I know. Got drive on the idols at the top, I don't do titles. Will I stop, I don't do rock. See, I like how he does a lot of play on little words here and there within it, which I'm not going to stop for every single one, but he does that a lot. Like idol, idol, like the person that you look up to, but also idol, like standing idly, not really moving or, or doing much they love to talk about me i know got drive on the idols at the top i don't do titles will i stop i don't do rivals i just hop in a new cycle when i drop it it go viral now my pockets need lipo whoa whoa what you want they want it back i know i'm nice cool as ice but you want me bad a lot of haters do me favors and they want me mad i just get the training and i lay them on the tracks play it back, play it back. i got suicide doors for you suit and tie whores my side of the sewers ain't yours i like the way that he pronunciated that i got suicide doors like the way yo <laughs> I probably didn't say it like he did, but the way he changed up his delivery for that was dope. Oh, well, what you want? They want it back. I know I'm nice, cool as ice, but you want me bad. A lot of haters do me favors and they want me mad. I just get the training and I lay them on the tracks, play it back. Play it back. I got suicide doors for you, suit and tie whores. My side of the sewers ain't yours. Go and purse your lips at me while my wife get Michael Kors. Want to judge me whole court while I sport the Michael George? Know you like it, that's for sure. This is my life, you spite it, but you like it to be yours. Call me corny, but I'm popping. I get Views like top floors, they can call me corny, but I'm popping popcorn, like stuff like that. He said a few, there's a lot of different things. The purse, like, there, okay, there's a few things he said in this. It, it's hard to stop and point out every single thing because this man does it in almost every single bar. Stab me while my wife get Michael Kors, want to judge me, hold court while I sport. Like, want to judge me, hold court. 
purse your lips at me. My wife get Michael Kors, the purse is like, there's so much happening all at once. Yours, go and purse your lips at me while my wife get Michael Kors. Want to judge me whole core while I sport the Michael George. Know you like it, that's for sure. This is my life, you spite it, but you like it to be yours. I like that. This is my life, you spite it, but you'd like it to be yours. I like that. I like that. I feel like that's the case with a lot of people that throw shade at people for absolutely no reason. And I mean, it, it can obviously come from a place of not liking someone, but it's like, all right, so there's people that I'm not a big fan of, or I don't really like the content that they make or the music that they make, right? And and so if I hear it, I'm, okay, just move to the next thing. Like, it's like the song says, on to the next one. Like, I just, I go watch something else or I listen to something else. But then there's that group of people that are like, I'm listening to something I don't like or watching something I don't like. And I'm going to sit here and I'm just going to, I'm going to fume about it a little bit. Then I'm going to go in the comments. and I'm going to type some nasty shit to them. Now, I'm not saying that I can understand where every, every, every person's mentality is coming from when it comes to that. But I just feel like you have to be in a certain space in life to feel like that's what you want to do. Because I come across videos all the time where I'm watching it and I'm like, okay, yeah, this, I don't really agree with this person's opinion. What I, like, I just go to the next video. I've never once thought to myself, like, well, let me go to, you're wrong, you're a piece of shit, you're da-da-da-da. Like, I've never, I've never thought to do that. And I just feel like that's a little bit odd. Like, if there's something that's not for you, there's nothing wrong with that. Like, you're not going to like everything and everybody's not going to be for you, but to just go to the next thing. This whole, like, need to be like, I need to be heard. Because of this, you stop the video too many times during this Knox reaction, I'm unsubscribing. It's like, bro, I, I don't care. Like what, like just do what you do, what makes you happy. That's what I want you to do. And if me stopping and talking, it doesn't make you happy. Then I feel like you probably should unsubscribe and there's nothing wrong with that. I'm not mad at you, but why you feel the need to announce it and tell me is just so odd. Like imagine like I'm watching like a TV show and I don't like something that happened to some character. And so I'm trying to call the studios. Like I'm not watching your show anymore. I'm upset. Like, it's like, yo, I don't know. It just doesn't make any sense. It's just so odd. Like now giving your opinion about things at times is, is different. Like in, in general, like if someone brought up a topic and you're like, ah, oh, you know what? Like, I don't really like this reactor. I like this. Rea you, I, you know what I'm saying? Does it make sense what I'm saying? I feel like there's, there's a gray area where like discussing things that you don't like is fine. It's just a certain approach of like trying to make sure that the person specifically sees it. Like, I don't like you. I'm not watching you anymore. It's just odd. To me, at least. Call me corny, but I'm popping. I get views like top floors. They can hate it, but they watching Michael Mean with popcorn too on this. Still, they want to pick it up and sick of all the chatter. I've been spitting real lyrics. All you critics never mad at Hill acidic. Why you tripping? I'm a rap to bring in rap. So you get wrapped up by the rapper. Check the baggage. Tell me that you vibing. You ain't got it. You ain't got it. Tell me that it's Tommy. You the problem. You the problem. Tell me who is riding. You ain't on it. You ain't on it. Tell me that you flying. You ain't drop shit. On. on to the next one. Ring the alarm. On to the next one. On, I'm on. Jared on to about the to next body one. Ring this. the alarm. Yeah. On to the next yeah. one. On, yeah. I'm on. On to the next one. Go hard to my death. Come the bully coming. And ring the alarm, nigga, death gun. You're gonna get stepped on. Microphone check when no feelings in my heart for these horrors. You know that's numb. Show me what the neck do. Exorcist has fun. Doing across the world, baby. Mama's getting egged on. Sharks smell blood. Better run when the meg come. I was out here starving, nigga. Feasting off of breadcrumbs. This man just got a voice for rap. Like, his voice is so dope. It really is. The next one, on, I'm on. On to the next one, ring the alarm. Yeah. On to the next yeah. one, on, yeah. I'm on. On to the next one, go hard till my death come. The bully coming, ring the alarm, nigga, death gun. You're gonna get stepped on. Microphone check, when no feelings in my heart for these horrors, you know that's numb. Show me what the neck do. Exorcist, head spun, doing across the world, baby. Mama's getting egged on. Shark smell blood, better run when the meg come. I was out here starving, nigga, feasting off of breadcrumbs. That's done, CZ, scorpion, S1, I kill for my babies. <laughs> Rum, might fly out to China just to ball on them step fun razor blades fake knife pistol on my left thumb my niggas went from ex cons to invested in hedge fund a slim chance of every player being the next brought a clown to break his neck on the neck to try to impress bum oh i like that slim okay hold up hold up hold up hold up step fun razor blades fake knife pistol on my left thumb my niggas went from ex cons to invested in hedge funds i like that my niggas went from ex cons to investing in hedge funds that's good. He's keeping the right people around him. Slim chance of every player being the next Bron. That's dope as well. Slim chance of every player being the next Bron. Everybody wants to be, but I don't think there's anything wrong with wanting to be that because it keeps your drive there, right? Like if you're like, yo, I'm going to be the next this, and you know that that's a, that's a tall task, is going to keep you driven and trying to be the best you. Now, I don't think that you should try to like ever emulate somebody and try to, you know, necessarily take their spot, but it's more so the greatness that they've achieved. 
that you want to achieve for yourself. And so it keeps you working on you, working on you, working on you. And I think that that's a beautiful thing. Clown to break his neck on the net to try to impress bums. No weapon form against me, she'll prosper, nigga. I'm Hold up, did he say a clown on the net breaking his neck to try to impress bums? It sounds like TikTok. It sounds like a lot of TikTok where people be doing some of the dumbest shit ever to impress some people and get a couple of views. In the next bro, the clown to break his neck on the net to try to impress bums. No weapon form against me, she'll prosper, nigga. I'm Teflon. T tell me that you vibing, you ain't got it. You ain't got it. Tell me that it's Tommy, you the problem. You're the problem. Yeah. Tell me who is riding, you ain't on it. You ain't on it. Tell me that you flying, you ain't drop sh on. On to the next one, ring the alarm. On to the next one, on I'm on. On to the next one, ring the alarm. On to the next one, on I'm on. This was fire. This was actually really, really dope. I've enjoyed everything we've checked out from Knox, but I will say even in the short amount of time that I've done some reactions to him over like what the past the past year on this channel, I feel like he has elevated his flows. Like you could tell that he's constantly working on his craft and I feel like that's extremely respectable. I, I really do enjoy that. This, this, was, uh, this was dope. This was dope. Shout out to Knox. Shout out to Jaren. They did their thing on this one. Let me know what you guys thought about it down below. Your favorite parts, all that kind of stuff. I'm always curious to see what you guys think. Again, I will be live tonight, twitch.tv slash Dwayne TV. At midnight, I'll be doing a reaction to Eminem. I will be live earlier doing some multiverses, uh, which is just, you know, it's a, it's a game kind of like Smash Bros. So if anybody wants to stop in for that, I will be there probably around like 9 p.m. We'll play till up around midnight and then we'll switch over we'll do the Eminem reaction I will have the chat on the screen probably like right here so if you guys are here in the chat you want to drop flame emojis whatever it talk about what it is that you liked in it I'm probably going to be more focused on the reaction but I may look over at chat once or twice pick out some of the things that you guys said discuss it you know get more of your guys' opinion and so it'll kind of be like a joint reaction between all of us so if anybody's interested make sure that you guys stop in my twitch link is down below but I appreciate you take it easy stay safe I'll catch you in the next one homies